Good morning, everyone. I just wanted to uh, put a video out uh, this morning, just a quick video to let everybody know uh, what's happening. Uh, with the weather that we have out here today, uh, the convoy is not moving. It will not roll today. Uh, we are uh, basically all just set up. I went down here, as you can see, I'm in a motel room. Just going to relax for the day. They uh, uh, do not want any, uh, you know, possibilities of having accidents or anything like that. They're calling for uh, four to eight inches of snow. Um, right now, I mean, I woke up this morning. I went to bed. Actually, went to bed last night wearing a T-shirt as I as I came in here. And uh, uh, this morning I woke up and there's uh, a good four inches of snow on the car and it's still just coming down out there uh, rather hard. And safety is the number one thing here at the convoy. So we, we are not rolling today. Uh, we don't want any accidents. We don't want anybody getting hurt. Uh, that's not what we came down here for. Now there's word that we may still have a congressman coming in today at one o'clock. I will try to keep up with what's going on. If there is, I will go down to the uh, speedway and try to video that for you. Um, if not, uh, well, well, we'll probably be back at this again tomorrow. But uh, I ran across some news this morning and I wanted to share this with you. Bear with me. This is my first time doing a share screen, so I'm hoping this works this up and I'm going to let this play for you I come to y'all with a heavy heart and I know that I can't keep quiet any longer the ones who know too much have been removed upon information and belief money is being spent for personal and political gain luxuries for administrators not convoyees the evidence is in plain sight twenty two thousand dollars a day for security that sits in their cars and protects only the administrators. $23,000 per week per Prevo bus plus fuel. Allied Universal Security is sabotaging the convoy. The convoy is more than just the people's convoy. It is made up of an alliance of convoys. We are not their pawns. The convoy leads are left in the dark on purpose. There is no plan. The Alliance has the tools to take over and lead the convoy. Mike and Brian's hearts are pure and have good intentions for the cause. The faces of the People's Convoy are being used as puppets, playing into the government's hands. Do not enter DC. We are smarter than that. We deserve better. United we stand, divided we fall. Be safe. I come to y'all with a heavy heart, and I know that I can't keep quiet. Sorry about that. Like I said, that was my first time trying to do that. Uh, I'll get this going as I go. As you can see, we have infiltrators uh, in our convoy. Uh, it's uh, even in our security. Uh, they're trying to uh, rip us off. Uh, they're not protecting everyone. They're just protecting themselves. You know, this is not Brian Browsey. This is not. Uh, uh, oh boy, I just dropped a, dropped a name here. Um, Mike, this is not Mike. This is not any of the leaders of this convoy that are doing this. This is people we hired to do a job for us and they're not doing a job and they are instigating, uh, uh, to go down into DC. They are, you know, uh, uh, taking uh, money to protect themselves but and take care of themselves but not to protect the people of the convoy so this is something that we got to look into and uh, uh, fix for a better a lack of a better word we need to fix it um, I'm sure it's being looked into right now but I just like I said I just wanted to bring you this quick message to let you know that the convoy is not rolling today uh it will possibly roll again tomorrow if the roads clear up well enough that we can safely do this if not then uh we will keep you updated and let you know
but uh, just uh, sit tight. I will bring you any news I can as I hear it. Uh, you guys have a great day. God bless and take care.